The Cameron community is mourning the loss of two men who died after their boat capsized while they were fishing on a Milan County property yesterday. Both of those men were well known athletes at Cameron Yo High School. Six News reporter Andrew Moore explains how much the community is remembering them. In a few brief moments, the Cameron community lost two local athletes, two promising young men in a boat accident on Sunday. 30-year-old Desmond Williams had played basketball for Cameron Yo, and 22-year-old Treyon Smith had established himself as a football legend. He was just a sophomore at the time. Uh, we, we played our first ball game and he rushed for over 200 yards. Coach Rick Rhodes says it didn't take long to realize Treyon was something special on the field. Several state championships later, there was no question. You know, he broke all of the records and was the leading rusher in Central Texas by the time that he graduated. Trayvon Smith left a legacy already in stone. His name is etched on not one, but two different monuments right outside the football stadium. And Coach Rhodes says off the field, he was just as special. He just got a personality that, that everybody loves. And, uh, you know, he's going to be he, he, he's going to be so missed. And yet inexplicably, when the men were fishing together on Sunday, their boat capsized. Neither would make it back to shore, leaving behind a tough community that has only started to heal. You know, Yo Nation, it, it, you know, lost a big, big part of, of what they are or, or who they are uh, yesterday. So it, it just breaks my heart. Mm. That was Andrew Moore for us. Smith was recovered on Sunday. However, Williams's body remained hidden underwater until about 3.30 this afternoon because of lake weed in that pond. The Morgan's Point dive team worked with the Texas game wardens all day to recover Williams.